Hi, in this video, I'll show you on how to use Record Choice Set. Record Choice Set can be used to get records and show them on a screen flow. Say, for example, you want to get all the opportunity records and let your user choose um, any of those opportunities on the screen flow. So let's start. I'll show you how it works. So this is an example of a Record Choice Set. You will have a pick list, which will show all the list of opportunities that are in your Salesforce org. In order to create this is, again, we're going to go to home, click on the gear icon. And since I already created one, um, a screen flow previously, I'm just going to do that again. Click, click on that, then click edit, and now you would see this is my previous screen. We're going to add a, um, a variable to store the record choice set. So we're going to click on new resource, select the resource type. We're going to choose record choice set. And for the API name, we're going to go RC for record choice opportunity. Well, the leaving convention, you can decide which one to follow. Now I'm going to go to opportunities. Is I want to get opportunity records. I'm going to do all since I want to get all those opportunities. But then also you can also filter to go, get only the records for the opportunities that you want. Say, for example, you want to close, you want to filter them with to get just get the opportunities with the amount that have 10,000. So if you choose this option on the record choice options, all you see would be the opportunities that have amount that are equals to 10,000, or you can do does not equal greater than or less than 10,000. So if it's less than 10,000, it would show you all the opportunities that has amount of less than 10,000. But since I want to get all opportunities, I'm just going to go do none and get all opportunities and then head down here. For the choice label, I want to choose name. So it would provide me with the list and show the names of the opportunities. And then click text and then ID in here. And I can also sort this opportunity. Um, I can do ascending and sort ascending and sort them by name or descending. So we'll do descending for now and then click done. Now we're going to go back to our screen flow and click on pick list. Again, you can either click on it or drag and drop to add a component. So this one is I'm going to label it as opportunities. And next is we're going to get and add the record choice set in here. We're going to select the variable that we created for the record choice for opportunity, click it, click done. Now save it and run. Now there you have it. It's sorted uh, in descending order alphabetically by name. And that's how you create and use record choice set to show lists of records and a screen flow. If you find if you found this video helpful, please don't forget to like and subscribe to my YouTube channel. Thank you.